everyone. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Rayanne. If you are new to my channel, and yeah, today I'm going to be doing another boxy charm unboxing because I did receive my boxy charm super early this month. So I decided to do boxy charm get ready with me, like early because I got it so early and I really did love this box and love the items we got in it this month. So yeah, if you would like to see the items that I got in this month's boxy charm, then please keep watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up and comment down below if you signed up for boxy charm or if you would like to sign up for boxy charm and if I can convince you to sign up for boxy charm. So yeah, let's get to the video. So we're going to start with the items in our boxy charm. And the first item that I already opened up was this Dr. Brandt's Pore Debrasion Pore Perfecting Exfoliator. This is an exfoliator you put on your pores, you leave it on there for a couple minutes and it's supposed to like soak in, do work. But I did use this before I applied my makeup today. And like, I don't know, you can still see my pores so I don't know what what good it really is doing but I have been changing my skincare routine so I did like how my makeup applied today while using this I'm just going to continue using this it says you use it twice a week with three days breaking up in between each week so I'm going to continue to use it and yeah I really enjoyed this product it retails for like $58 and that's a really really awesome deal because Dr. Brandt is a very expensive brand and I know a lot of people like his products. I have got this in a sample size before but it lasted me like one or two uses so I couldn't really tell what it did for my skin. It didn't do anything right off the bat but yeah so far I think this is really good and I'm excited to use it. The next product is probably the best product I think I've ever gotten from a box charm like ever. Like I love this product so much. It is this Becca highlighter. It's the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector pressed highlighter in Prosecco Pop. I believe this is the one that Jaclyn Hill made. I believe she made Champagne Pop and Prosecco Pop, if I'm not mistaken. This retails for $38, and yes, it's absolutely gorgeous. I own one other highlighter. I think it's like in Moonlight or something from Becca, and I really, really love it. It's very subtle, but it's kind of too light for my skin tone, so I don't use it very often unless I like just want like a bright white inner corner highlight on my eyes but this is just so awesome like it's this beautiful beautiful gold shimmery color I love it it's beautiful gold like I love gold highlights so this is perfect for me I'm so glad we got this so let's put it on our face. The first thing I always do when I get my highlighter is I always highlight my inner corners. I didn't do that first because I wanted to use this highlight so I did the rest of my makeup and waited to finish it with my highlight. So pretty. It's very, very golden. Wow. Like <laughs> that is very, very vibrant and like wow. It's so pretty. I love it. And I'm going to take a little bit and highlight underneath my brow bone. So pretty. It's totally my skin tone. I don't know if it would work well if you have light skin tones, but I think if you have a medium to dark skin tone, this is the perfect highlight for that. I really love it, and I think it just became one of my favorite highlighters. I like the Becca highlights because they're like not really glittery they're more like skin highlight but so far I'm totally loving this highlight usually I like spray my face with setting spray so it kind of dims it down because I don't know like I like a bright shiny highlight but then I like it to look subtle and blends into my skin so this is freaking awesome I absolutely freaking love it it's a gorgeous highlight. I very much like it. This is a total win. This is retails for $38. It's worth the entire box to me because I would have bought this because I like the highlights. I always have. So yeah, let's move on to the next product. Next product I got is this lip pencil. It's by Jonte Blue. Or yeah, I'm guessing that's what it's called. Jonte Blue. 
It's a lip liner pencil and it retails for $5. I really, really don't like stick um, lip liners because I hate sharpening them. It just, it's like inconvenient when I'm like trying to put it on. I'm like, oh crap, I need to sharpen it and I have to go find my sharpener. Like I just don't enjoy that. So I'm not a fan of that, but let's see how it applies. It's in this shade, I forgot to say what shade it is. It's in the shade called Brown Sugar in 943. I, it's a very pretty mauve color, kind of like the shirt I'm wearing. Like, it's a pretty color. It's called brown sugar. You think it would be brown, but it's like red, <laughs> like a mauve red color. I mean, but. It retails for $5, so it's not like it's super expensive, but it's kind of drying, like, on my lips. And I have, like, other lip liners that aren't as drying, but this one was, like, very drying. The next product we got in here, this TARDIS lip paint. And this is in the shade Delish, which I don't own. I have, like, three other TARDIS lip paints, and I really, really like the formula of them. And they have like this moussey kind of formula that like dries down super fast and it's really really comfortable for my lips so i do like this i'm gonna swatch it that's what it looks like it pretty much matches the lip liner like exactly so let's put it on isn't that crazy i didn't put any on the bottom of my lips and i just smacked my lips together and it's like all the way on the bottom of my lips. It's crazy. I don't think I've ever done that with a lipstick and it's like absolutely perfect. Like it just left. I forgot to say how much this retails for. It retails for $20 and it's the Quick Dry Matte Lip Paint. And it's freaking dry, it's very matte and the thing what I like about this is it's very comfortable. It's not like super uncomfortable when it goes on your lips. So. I like that. That is definitely a win. One of my favorite products that I got. I think this is probably one of my favorite boxes that I've got. Like, I know we got boxes that had eyeshadows and I thought they were like my favorite. But this one, I really do like the lip paint. I like having a lip pencil and I love the highlight. And I love having like an exfoliator because I like to exfoliate my face every few days because I think it's good for my skin. So I really, really like it. Okay, last but not least, we have this little kit it's called nailed it and it looks like they teamed up with boxycharm it is the ncla los angeles nail company and it comes with this cute little nail kit you get some scissors i really don't know like the special looking thing one of these things a little file and some clippers i think this is a really awesome like it's not something that I would like go out and buy, but it's really convenient to get and that I can just like throw it in my purse because you never know when you need something like this until you need it. And there are plenty of times that I could have used this and I didn't have it. So this retails for $18 and it is a five piece tool set. And I really, I really think this is awesome. Like I think this box is really good. I mean, all together, I think everything's like 139 around there. If I did the math in my head right, we basically got a bunch of products worth $139 for $21 a month. This is a great deal. I love BoxyCharm. I will always love BoxyCharm. It's probably one of my favorite subscription boxes I've ever, ever been on. And like I look at other, other subscription boxes and nothing compares to what BoxyCharm is to me. So I definitely love it and I highly recommend it. So those were the items that I got in my BoxyCharm. I really, really thought this month was worth it. it had a lot of items that I loved, a lot of items that I would use on a day-to-day -day basis, and it's not something I'm going to throw to my side. Like, I always say, like, I love the items in the BoxyCharm, which I truly do, but some of the items I just end up throwing to the side and I don't use as much. There are, like, some staples that I use every day in my single makeup that I got in my BoxyCharm, and some of these will probably be one of them. That highlight was just absolutely gorgeous, and I love it because it totally spits my skin tone, and if you have skin tone my color or darker skin tone like this highlight will be really good for your skin tone so yeah i really loved this month's boxycharm i hope that you get boxycharm and i will leave a link down below so you can sign up it's 21 dollars a month it's very affordable 
and you get so much products. It's a great way to build your makeup collection. Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below and I will see you next time.